Hi, it's your coach Joe Lucas. Welcome to your Practice Power Daily Power Minute. Welcome to Thursday. Welcome to the 24th of January. Hey, as we uh, as we get going here in 2013, uh, let's talk about, well, for lack of better terms, keeping score. Uh, you know, as an industry, let's say so we run on numbers, uh, households, assets, uh, premium, all that stuff, and most firms do a pretty good job of tracking what I call the results of things, right? What are you doing in terms of tracking your activities? Now, I'm not coaching for almost 21 years now. I, I'm not a big fan of like tracking everything where you spend your whole day, you know, basically tracking what you're doing. It kind of is a, uh, it kind of is self-defeating. But there are a couple things that I think every advisor needs to really have a handle on. You know, if we were an athlete, uh, if we were a runner, we would have a running log, right? Time, distance, so, so on and so forth. Uh, if you're any other kind of athlete, you know, hey, look, measurement is, is a key component uh, of training. Well, in our world, measurement also is a key component of success. So what do I want you to really track if I had my choice? Well, there's really a few things, you know, and I was, I was called, I used to call it, I still do kind of the, the one-hand daily game plan, but let's talk in terms of just making sure we're doing certain things. First and foremost is you want to always keep accountable to your morning ritual. So in other words, did I do my morning ritual today? Check. Next thing, do I have a written month, a written daily game plan for today? Check. Right. Now the, here are three things that we want to be very, very aware of. Number one, contacts, inbound, outbound. We want to track that. Okay, very important. Number two, how many meetings? Have we scheduled today? Review meetings, initial meetings. What's our calendar look like? Third, how many introduction conversations are we going to have today? So really five things to track. Now, you can track them on a spreadsheet. Uh, you might be able to track them on, inside your system. Uh, if, you're a, uh, if you're a member of uh, Practice Power, and I hope you are, uh, you could track it uh, in LifeTick, our, our, our goal and tracking uh, uh, platform that we use. The bottom line is, you know, what you want to know is every month, how many contacts, how many introduction conversations, how many meetings, every quarter, same three things. When you come time to do your 2014 business plan, which I know is, it sounds like it's a long way away, you want to be able to sit there and say, here's how many contacts I did in 2013, here's how many introduction conversations I had in 2013, here's how many meetings I had in 2013. Those are really the three things that are really run probably 80% of your success in this industry. Be aware of those. Look, if we had a goal of losing weight, we'd be jumping on the scale. If you have a goal of increasing your business, your revenue, those three things, and then obviously the morning ritual and daily game plan, total of five, are the elements that you need to be very aware of each and every day. Okay? So, have a great day today, and I'll see you tomorrow for the end of the week.